Good day everyone! Welcome to the Medical Colleges of the Northern Philippines and International School of Asia and the Pacific. I am Aristotle Molina Gonzalez, the Dean of the Office of Student Services. I am here to give to you some of the details when it comes to our office. Definitely, you will share it and you will enjoy it. I'd like to begin by saying, the vision of the Office of Student Services. It is for the development of every student in becoming a total person by providing activities and experiences that could help cultivate their talents and potentials, especially to its fullest. The mission of the Office of Student Services shall provide assistance to students for their adjustment and development in the pursuit of their aspirations to become informed, technically competent, and well-rounded healthcare professionals and entrepreneurs in the future. And definitely, the philosophy is towards a more proactive and empowered student trees. We, the Office of Student Services, will always be here so that you will always be guided of what the things, what will happen, and definitely an enjoyable academic journey at MCNP and ISAP. For this point, or at this point, let me introduce to you my kapamilya, my kapuso, my kapatid in the office, Ma'am Beverly Cano, our scholarship coordinator, Ma'am Elena Figueroa, our coordinator in terms of health services, Sir Joshua Masiddo, our head in the publication office, who will also have a role play when it comes to, or a role I should say, in the, the quill the official publication of the MCNP and ISAP, Sir Jeffrey Gackle, our sports coordinator, Sir John Carlos Suyu, our head in the guidance office, and definitely Sir J. Mark Flores, our student activities coordinator. Definitely, these are the people who will help you so that you will be able to have an enjoyable journey in MCNP and ISAP. The Office of Student Services also offered a student development program for you to enhance your potentials, your skills, and definitely your talents. We have a student organization and activities which we would like you to be involved. Leadership training program, student publication, multi-faith services, sports and development programs, the culture programs, and one of a kind, our special program. We are also offering other services like we issued also certificate of good moral character not only during graduation but you will also be needing this certificate of good moral character for applications in the scholarship conduct students forum especially we do this now with the online platform using the Facebook page of the MCNP and ISAP issuance of student handbooks and affidavit of acknowledgement of school policies. These are very, very much important for you to have a copy so that you will always be guided with the guidelines, protocols, and policies of our school. Issuance of gate pass only for those who have transportation in coming inside the school and also request a slip for a new identification card. What are the major activities that we are offering in the student services? Orientation program. In the orientation program, we will be able to discuss the vision, mission, the graduate attributes, and other guidelines and policies in the different non-academic offices of these two institutions. Parents Forum. This is also one way for us to engage with parents so that they will also be able to understand or to understand what is their role in the academic journey of their children and they will also be able to understand the policies and guidelines of MCNP and ISAP. The Dedication Day. This is a special program for our founder, Dr. Ronald P. Guzman, who always inspire us to do what is good and continue what is good. The Recognition Day. It is in here. We will always applaud that we will always give recognitions for those who are academic scholars, the Dean's Lister and the President's Lister, the Leadership Camp. Since we are in the pandemic, we will not be able to have a face-to-face -face Leadership Camp, but we will always give this in a virtual platform. For those who wanted to serve the student tree, please join us with our Leadership 
seminar with our leadership webinar wherein you will be able to enhance your leadership skills intramurals you know what with this season of pandemic we cannot have a face-to-face -face basketball a face-to-face -face volleyball or any or any intramurals activity for that matter but the MCNP and ISAP will always give you a wonderful experience using the online platform. That's why the intramurals, we will now call it as electronic murals or the e-sports, wherein we will be using the online platform. Next, the celebration of the Buwan ng Wika. We will always have our nationalism as one of the core values of the MCNP and ISAP. That's why we will always continue to have the celebration for our language. The Christmas Fellowship, the Foundation Day Celebration, Parangal sa Magulang, and definitely the Graduation Day. The Office of Student Services will always be your kalakbay with these activities. Aside from these major activities, the Office of Student Services also holds the clubs and organizations, a co-curricular in nature that is an extension of the classroom activities and are not open to membership for all. And I'd like to explain this. Because there are some organizations wherein it is only suited for a specific department. Let me begin. What are these clubs and organizations accredited by the Office of Student Services? One, we have the academic organization, the Student Nurses Society. It is only intended for students who are taking up Bachelor of Science in Nursing. We also have the Radiologic Technology Student Society or the RTSS. And for sure, this is only intended for the Radiologic Technology Students, the Association of Physical Therapy Students or the APTS, only intended for those students enrolled in the physical therapy. The Philippine Society of Medical Technology Students or the FISMET, it is only intended for those students who are taking up the medical in laboratory science. And the last, the Guild of Pharmacy Students or the GPS, only for those students who are taking up BS in pharmacy. It is not only about the academic organizations that's so active when it comes to the activities of the Office of Student Services or the institution for that matter. We also have the extracurricular activities. These extracurricular activities tend to be a bridge between the Office of Student Services and the students. Because of these extracurricular activities, we tend to be very active in many activities for that matter, whether it will be on online and we will be able to have the face-to-face. -face. Number one, we have the highest student body organization of the twin institution, the Council of Leaders. It is in here wherein we develop the leadership potentials of our students. Those who are members of the Council of Leaders, definitely, they will always be a working arm of the Office of Student Services in implementing activities that definitely will help the student development holistically. The Adolescent Reproductive Health or the Peer Helping Group. This is a special, I can say, a special club organization from the Guidance Services Office wherein it will help the students to understand about reproductive health and definitely for guidance services. And finally, we can also have the Sports and Athletic Club. For those who are sports enthusiasts, Please look for the advisor of the sports and athletic clubs. Who knows, you will be able to join a provincial, regional, national. And who knows, one of you will be an Olympic player. The campus ministry, it is one way for us to develop our faith to our dear God and also our relationship with others. The campus ministry is not only about singing, but definitely they play a very special role in the spiritual formation of our students. The campus ministry will be our bridge and our katukayo or our kalakbay. The Red Cross Youth, the Social Cultural Club, and also the ISERVE movement. These are the other extracurricular organizations and club with that will definitely help you to become what you wanted to be in the future. These organizations will definitely help us to become one 
and we will be able to develop and continue flying higher. These are the extracurricular organizations. Let me walk you also through to the special programs of our institution. This is a very unique program that only at MCNP and ISAP wherein you can find these special programs. This special program is supposed to be on a face-to-face -face basis, but since we cannot have it because of this pandemic, definitely we will use the virtual platform. And I'd like you to note that this is only a temporary virtual special program. Sooner or later, we will be able to meet you face-to-face -face as we will be able to have these special programs for a specific college or first by specific year level i should say the office of student services in collaboration with the guidance services office will give you the discovery weekend why is it that it is a discovery weekend because it is intended for the first year for you to be able to adjust yourself in a environment we're in for the college life the Discovery Weekend will help you to discover definitely yourself, other people, and also definitely your dear God. The Discovery Weekend will help you also guide you what will be the best course most probably that you are taking in hand. Why is it that you are having this course at this moment? The Friendship Camp. It is a special program for the second year students. We're in this second year students will be able to discover what is friendship camp in a deeper perspective their relationship with others and definitely the relationship with their god the camp of colors it is a third year special programs third year college students you are very much welcome here the moment you will be able to reach the third year college there will be many conflicts along the way the camp of colors will definitely remove your mask so that you will be able to focus more when it comes to your education. And finally, when you will reach the fourth year high school, we will have the success plus ready to conquer. Aliman now today, tomorrow the world. This is the Office of Student Services, wherein kami ang inyong makakalakbay para sa mas magandang buhay dito sa eskwelahan MCNP and ISAP. Keep safe everyone. Maraming maraming salamat po. And I know, magkikita tayo not only virtually, but basically through face-to-face. -face. Again, ako po ang inyong lingkod, ang inyong kalakbay, ang inyong kasama, Sir Aristotel Gonzalez, the Dean of the Office Student Services. Mabuhay MCNP, mabuhay ISAP.